After months of applications and interviews, it looks as if our district is one step closer to having a new superintendent in place soon. By air date, we will know the final vote of the board, which is expected to offer the position at the November 15th meeting. Hawkeye News anchor Natalie Hillary is again on special assignment and brings us a closer look at what we know about the future leader of Red Oak ISD. Natalie? Thanks, Christian. Red Oak ISD is about to enter a new era under the leadership of Mr. Craig Stocksdale, who was named Superintendent of Schools at the November 15th board meeting. The school board has chosen Mr. Stocksdale for the position of Superintendent of Schools for Red Oak ISD from many who applied for the position. After selecting Mr. Stocksdale in October, the law states the school district must wait 21 days after naming the lone finalist before the district can hire him. Our producer Alan Oliver attended the meeting on November 15th and got a chance to talk to Mr. Stocksill about his new position at Red Oak ISD. Well, my vision first is I need to find a vision. I need to find out what Red Oak ISD, obviously you have an outstanding district and I need to find out what's going on here and what you're doing well and see if I have anything that I can offer to tweak it. I believe I have a few ideas, but the first thing to do is to find out and learn about Red Oak ISD. We're certainly uh, pleased to be considered a superintendent candidate for such a wonderful district. Mr. Stocksill is currently the superintendent at Floresville ISD, which is located south of San Antonio. Mr. Stocksill brings over 20 years of administrative experience to Red Oak ISD. He has been credited with many accomplishments while at Floresville, including improved academic performance, he passed an $18.6 million bond package, reorganization of central office, he improved staff development, he started a junior ROTC program with 130 students, and he led the district in design and construction of new facilities. Mr. Stocksill is 51 years old and is married to his wife, Kathy, who is a teacher. The Stocksills have one daughter who is married and Mr. Stocksill has one grandson. Mr. Stocksill grew up in Weatherford and graduated in 1968. He has attended college at Weatherford College, TCU, and received his superintendent certification from North Texas State University. Mr. Stocksill has been superintendent at Blum ISD, Marion ISD, Whitesboro ISD, and at Floresville since July 2000. Floresville is a 4A school district with similar numbers to Red Oak and has been a recognized district under Mr. Stocksill's leadership. Texas Monthly in November 2001 rated Floresville ISD a five-star school district under Mr. Stocksill's leadership. Mr. Stocksill has been called a very hands-on leader who really becomes involved with the students and teachers. By the time the show airs, Mr. Stocksill will be the new superintendent of schools for Red Oak ISD and will be set to take over the office in January. We here at Hawkeye News would like to thank Mr. Raisler for doing a great job as interim superintendent. And we want to welcome you, Mr. Stocksill, and your wife to Red Oak ISD. We hope to have an opportunity to get to know Mr. Stocksill much better in the coming months as he begins a new era for Red Oak ISD under his leadership in 2005. Reporting from Red Oak ISD Administration Office, I'm Natalie Hillary. See you back in the studio next month.